is the big problem in the world. Every five seconds, one people blind. And every one minute, one child blind in the world. In Indonesia, the blindness rate 1.5%. Almost 4 million people blind in Indonesia. And in Bali, more than 50,000 people blind and about 30,000 people caused by cataract. Blind people in Indonesia or in Bali live in the village and poor and very difficult access to the hospital. That's why we need the breakthrough how to bring eye treatment very close to the blind people. The activity of the mobile eye clinic mass eye screening the patient will be checking one by one by our team to know what is their problem school eye screening Glasses. Free medicine and cataract surgery. Since 2010, we already developed our program to other provinces of Indonesia. Since 1991, we already done 33,000 cataract surgeries and the every year about 2.5 thousand cataract surgery and especially in 2011, we did almost 4,000 cataract surgeries. Yeah, bro. 
Production also have program, Prostatic Eyes, Clip Clip and Palette Program, and Education Assistant Program. Clip Clip and Palette Program, we run 1989. Until now, we did more than 1,000 people, especially in children and poor, uh, poor family. This is not just a Band-Aid therapy, that we are training local staff, the norms being my offsider for a number of years now. He's an exceptionally talented surgeon and my hope is that he'll go on and train other surgeons so that this legacy will live on because just simply coming and patching something up achieves a gain for that particular family but as a whole it, um, it doesn't achieve a lot, whereas I think John's mission has been to train local people. We use all local anaesthetists, local nursing staff, local doctors, and um, it's a pleasure to, to see how that's evolved. Different patients, different problems, need different skills. I must to improve my skill for different patients different case uh, for the best uh, result for the, the children. In this, you know, I would say maybe what the parents I think would like yeah. would be a better lip. Okay. So therefore, if we're making a decision here, we probably look at making the appearance good first of all for mum and dad, yeah. all right? And then we will address the issue yeah. because uh, speech development is probably going to be very slow anyhow. All right. So there's not really a need to be doing the palette for this speech, if you like, but to make mum and dad happy and to show you how to improve on the lip, maybe this is one to make a better appearance of the lip. I'm John Louis de Souza. I'm from uh, Perth, oculoplastic surgeon at the Lions Eye Institute, and uh, I've been involved uh, for the last few years with the John Fawcett Foundation in um, performing and supervising oculoplastic surgery here. So recently, we've had uh, Dr. Dinny from the foundation down to Perth to visit me and my colleagues and um, watch us do surgery um, there in Perth for about a month in 2012. And now this is my first visit back after that uh, visit by Dinny and I'm supervising her doing some simple procedures on eyelids and with uh, more complicated problems in the sockets and uh, with tumours around the eye uh, here in Bali. In this program uh, I can do surgery for many patients and uh, involve uh, more than five ophthalmologists from Indonesia and I'm very happy because Dr. Jen Louis de Sousa come and uh, beside me in this surgery. For me and my colleagues that operate in Perth and uh, in Western medicine, uh, being able to come over here and to transfer our skills or to teach the local people how to manage these problems is a very rewarding. Processic eyes to help the children and young people with the plastic eyes to change their life, change their future. Thank you very much to the John Fawcett Foundation for giving me a new eye and a new life. Education Assistant Program to help the children from the poor family to get their 
school. With $100, you can help the children to continue their education for one year. Introduce this patient, girl five years old, already cataract since birth. Cataract, we call cataract congenital, with uh, complication. The first complications with the synechia fibrotechnic nucleus and then uh, already esotrophia and nystagmus. I already done the surgery with a small incision cataract surgery and uh, before we insert the implant we do the vitrectomy to make sure the everything will be clear and after we insert the implant we uh, with the uh, small incision we with interrupted uh, stitch and we hope it will be better fusion. Even that uh, we do the surgery too late, but I think better do the surgery than without do something for this patient.